Hello and welcome to another tutorial from Xenotrust. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to display breadcrumb navigation menu, uh, well, breadcrumb navigation bar in your WordPress website. So the first thing I want you to do is to go to the back end of your website and I need you to come to plugins and click on add new. Okay, so we are here. Now I want you to search for breadcrumb. and nav so that's nav and then xt so breadcrumb nav xt this very first plugin we have here go ahead and install it as you can see it has over 800,000 installed and it's currently compatible with um, the latest version of wordpress so it's an it's a very active plugin all right next go ahead and activate it All right, now our plugin is activated. Um, to set it up on our website, I need you to come to settings here on the left bar, and I need you to locate the breadcrumb navigation settings. So this is it right here. So you can easily click on this, or as well, you can come to the breadcrumb plugin itself and click on settings. Okay, so we are here, right? Um, so now let's just go through some of the settings here. So um, so this is the breadcrumb separator. You need to leave this as is uh, because I, in my opinion, this is fine. Link current item. So this setting actually is asking you if you want the current item to still be as a link. So ideally it should be unchecked to just make it a text, okay? So page breadcrumb. Place the page number breadcrumb in a trail so um, i'm going to check this and so this is fine so let's see if there are other settings we need here so i think um other settings can be left as is go ahead and save changes and let's refresh our page so now let's refresh this page and let's see Okay, apparently um, our settings has not been activated on this page, so there must be a different way. So let's um, go back to the settings and look through properly. So to complete our settings, we need to come to appearance and click on customize um, and see the extra settings we have here. So in our customize, as you can see, we have breadcrumbs option here. So go ahead and click on it and there is the position option select the position and set it to after header okay well this doesn't mean you cannot try out the other options okay but i'm just going to go with after header here but then you can try out the other options available so you may have noticed that as i clicked on after header i immediately saw this home displayed here first off let's save this and refresh this page and see whether it displays so this is the login page and as you can see there is home and then there is breadcrumb so essentially that's how you can set up breadcrumb on your website and have it display um the way the page are uh, outlined or you know layout laid out so um thank you so much for watching this tutorial there are numerous settings you can try on this um breadcrumb here for example you may want to disable this breadcrumb on your home page so all you need to do is click on disable on home page and it should be disabled on home page and then if you want to disable on other pages go ahead and check them i'll click on publish and if i go to my home page you'll see that there will not be breadcrumb there so it, it's not enabled on the home page essentially that's how you can um, set up breadcrumb on your wordpress website thank you so much for watching this video if you're not subscribed to my channel please hit the subscribe button, turn on my post notification as I create great content for the web. Alright, see you later.